now we will award with a lifetime achievement a renowned American movie producer and director in recognition of his worldwide successful martial arts and action movies with Warner Bros. and for his work in the entertainment sector. Ladies and gentlemen, Julius Nasso! Welcome back in Monaco, and we have the, your microphone, and the question is that Thank I you. know that you started your career with a very, very famous director. Can you tell his name? There is a word that we use, and the word is privilege. And if we know the definition of privilege, I had the privilege of being Andrea, oh, excuse me, uh, Sergio Leone's uh, assistant, and Sergio he was my Leone, maestro. a legend as yes. well. <laughs> and uh, as a result of that, he's given me the opportunity, and I learned from one of the best maestros. And uh, I dedicated my life to him and the works that he's done in the entertainment business. How came to your mind the idea to realize martial arts movies? Well, that's a good question. I like these questions. Um, after many years of learning the actual production of putting all the elements together that we see when you turn on a theater, when you turn on a TV or you go to a theater, and it's all those elements, whether it's the music, to the ear, whether it's the texture of the film, the sight. So when it came time for me to get totally vested, my maestro said, you're ready now. What are you going to do and what is your first project? So I said, maestro. I'm gonna do an action film. And he looked at me and he said, action? So what do you mean action? I says, well, not only action, I'm gonna do a martial arts action film. He says, what are you, nuts? In Italian. <laughs> I can't say the words because they're a little vulgar. <laughs> so I said, Maestro, I says, right now I see that the demographics in these martial arts action films do very well. He says, but I taught you art. He says, what art is in an action film? Kicking and blowing up buildings and this. He says, you can't even get nominated for an Academy Award because action films do not fall in that category. Say maestro. I'm gonna take the art and all the talent that you've given me over the past six years, and I promise you, I'm gonna put it into martial arts action films. As a result of that, my first 10 films with 10 blockbusters broke records until today, 25 years later, are on every night all over the world and that's a result of the texture the sound of the film and which is your feeling in receive this lifetime achievement tonight for all this well we go back to privilege that's an important word First of all, I want to thank you over the past 25 years that I had the privilege to be with you, Tino, here in Monaco, for many, many big events, and obviously with His Highness Prince Albert. So I was very privileged to come to this country, the diamond 
of the world. So that was a privilege and an achievement. Secondly, I want to dedicate this award tonight to President Xi and the First Lady of China that has given me the privilege to be able to produce and co-direct one of the largest one of the largest concerts ever recorded in the entertainment industry. I brought Andrea Bocelli. The president gave me the privilege to put this concert together with 48 countries in front of 48 world leaders seen by 1.8 billion viewers with more than 10,000 people on the stage, broke all records with Guinness World of Records, and that was a privilege. That's great. My third really? privilege uh -huh. is that I'm an Italian. Yes, <laughs> Italian. A native Italian, Italian, and that's my your diamond. genius, maybe. <laughs> My diamond. <laughs> so it's time to award you. And please, come with the award. Give it to Christine. Take the microphone. Oh, playing. thank that's you. That's heavy. It's time to award hey, Judith time. Nasso. My wow. Let's do a photo. A photo here. you and I have to say that this artwork has been realized for you by Ivan Rando from Lugano thank you to Ivan Rando as well thank you Julius